Greetings guys and girls and fellow gamers, this is Games for Cakes and welcome to the zombie infested world of 7 days to die. So, today we have plants, look at this, look at this, I updated the church a little bit and I finished the ceiling, it looks gorgeous. Okay, so what are we going to do today is I added some more new recipes, the pew segments. The pew segments, get some wood. Leave the jars. Leave the jars. Okay. Okay. Now we do not need chairs chairs anymore. But I have designed the recipes to be this for the uh, left piece. The middle, then the right piece. It's not really sorted properly, isn't it? If three comes before two. The right piece is the long one on the right. And then the middle piece is like this. Okay. There we go. Now. Let's take this piece, we'll put one here, and here, and I think, well, let's just put one, yeah, and let's put the outer piece here, and let's put the middle piece here. Okay, that's what it looks like, and also, oh yeah, I changed my block.xml file for them not to be to be picked up, because they're basically like chairs, yeah, they're, you put them down and you can pick them up, but... I don't really see the point picking them up. Actually, in fact, a lot of blocks, I don't see the point picking up. I mean, sure, chairs, you might say, oh, I want to turn it, I want to turn it. It's like, yeah, use the left-click menu for it and turn it, you know, um, like every other block. But once you place it down, you should have to destroy it because you don't want to pick these things up accidentally. Okay, so um, now wood frames is a different story. I'm talking more about furniture and things like, you know. It's, uh, anyway, that's besides the point. So let's make two more. Make two more and two more. And see if it looks... Oh, oh, nice. It actually has a space. That is so good. Because I wasn't sure if it's going to have a space or not. And, oh, this is, this is looking good. This is looking good. Oh, I like that. Oh, this is... Oh, nice. Yes. Okay, we have three, six, nine. Uh, well, no, hang on a second. Yeah, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one. So twenty-one pieces. Okay, let's get more wood. Twenty-one pieces. Three, and then twenty-one, and twenty-one, there we go, nice, oh this is gonna look so nice, this is gonna look so nice. Oh crap, now I need to make one more. Because I made them that you can't pick them up. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah. There you go. They're easy destroyed. They don't really destroy like wood, they look more like cloth. They have that kind of texture thing. Why did I make so many? Oh yeah, here, yeah. And... Okay. 
Now we have to talk to Brother John because this means a lot of people can fit into this church, probably more than he expected. There we go. Ah, you balls. I keep doing that. Now stop being such a ball. Okay, where did I put it? Here. It's always the same spot. Holy crap. Stop it. Okay. Yeah, that, that flicker with the light is really funny sometimes. You can see it there um, every now and then on the side. So there we go. Look at that. That is looking really nice. I like it. I like it. And I like that it's brown. I think the red looks good with the brown. Wow. This is looking nice. I really, really like it. And I think the cobblestone fits nicely. This is going to be awesome. Okay. Now, cobblestone. We need cobblestone. Now, what we want to do is... I think we actually... Let's... We should have put this one outside, actually. So... Oh, okay. Fair enough, there we go. And... Am I missing something? One, two... Okay, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know what I'm missing here. So we have one, two, three... Three, four. It's the same as we have over... Ah, yes, this is what we're missing. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. See the... Oh, no, there it's One, two, three, four, yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four. Then one, two, three. And then one... And then one, and then one. Okay, cool. There we go. So this is going to be our, uh, I suppose, tip or whatever you want to call it, our church hall. And this is going to go up all the way, pretty high. And on the front, what I was thinking is I was going to make this actually higher as well. But I don't know yet. We'll see. The top design is kind of still open. I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to do this. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to put loads and loads. I need to make more cobblestone frames. Oh, don't jump into the hole. Oh, oh whoa, 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 whoa. Need to make more cobblestone frames. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Cobblestone frames. Okay, nine. How about you make more sticks? Thank you. Okay, how about we make more sticks? Uh, yeah, that's good. I like that. That's a good size. And let's take my grass. Nice! Okay. That's good. 64, 64, and the rest of the grass, 58. Brilliant! Okay, I'm happy with that. Yes! Actually, leave the awning here because I don't think we need that for now. So leave that here and... Okay. Oh, we need to make more cobblestone rocks. Um, yeah, cobblestone rocks, cobblestone rocks, cobblestone rocks. It's cement and stone. So let's take the stone with us. I think we have cement in... Oh, we have cement here. Oh, look at that. 
We still, yeah, we take that with us, just in case we need to make more. It's always good to be prepared. Better safe than sorry. You never know when you need it all. You never know. Yeah, we still had some cement there, so let's cement here. Brilliant. And cobblestone here and the stone here, so that will make plenty of more cobblestone. I don't know why I took the plant fiber with me. The chairs can stay there, I don't care. We can use them as firewood. No, we're gonna need this now in a little while. And we need cement, uh, concrete, sorry. We need to make concrete. Yeah, we need more than that. Okay. Now, what we're doing here basically is, and I'm gonna use the shovel uh, in the beginning. Now, obviously what this is all about is that we need to make let me see. Okay, this is not cement, so... This guy here is as low as we're gonna go. But I thought we went lower inside here. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Because this is the basement. Okay, so I'm gonna have to go inside first. Sorry about this now, because... Um, eh. Okay, let's go up here. I forgot that... Um, we still have to sort out the basement, how low we need the basement. So if we have... Okay, let me... Sorry about that. I think we have to work on the basement first. So if we have that here... Then we want at least... Let me see. Because we want to have a ground as well, like of wood or whatever, you know, so um, probably cobblestone or whatever, or cement, like a, a concrete, it keeps saying cement, concrete. So let me think, what do we need? Pickaxe. Okay, so we have one, two, three, and then we have the cement ground. Is that going to be deep enough? Is that going to be... I think I wanted one deeper. Yeah, I think so. I think I wanted one more block. Because I like the ceilings high. I like I like rooms when they're high. So one, two, three. This is usually how I have my houses in the beginning. But I think I want to have that extra space. Yeah, I think so. So I'm just going to do this initial one for measuring. Yeah, so I want this one here, and this one here. Ah, I see, there we go. We already had a concrete block there, and a concrete block there. And then we want to go one more down. And this will have the ground. So for this, we can leave the stone there. I'm not really too concerned, because this will simply hold the concrete ground. Will it be concrete? I think, I think so, yeah. I think we leave the concrete, concrete, and then we can still put interior walls inside it. That's, I'm not too concerned about that. So interior walls can still go all the way around. The room is big enough. And um, we have a secret entrance coming from a different direction anyway. So I'm not too worried about that. So, okay. Excellent. Then that's what we're going to do. So let's get the auger out. And let's start auger, auger, auger. And actually, let's get a bit of light out. Nah. Um, let's, I suppose, put one here. And let's put one here. There we go. That way we have enough light for all the work we need to do. Yeah, that's a good idea. I think that's that's going to be working out well.
Okay, and we are back. Um, we have done a lot of work. You could see the all the stones are coming out, and wow, it was it was some work, wasn't it? Um, yeah. So let's. This is how big it actually is. Wow, it is so much bigger than I expected it to be. Now, um, what I need to do now is I want to make the wall here. So I will probably do another auger. Look at that. <laughs> you can see the night sky. So we're gonna do that a little bit and I won't be time lapsing that. I think the last time lapse was enough. And there we go. We have more, don't we? Yeah, we do. It is very, very um, satisfying in a way to see all this coming together. It is. And it gives us so much more stone for cement, which is great. Yeah, sorry, I'm trying not to talk too much while I'm doing this because the auger is just so loud. Okay. Oh, that shouldn't be. That should be stone down there. Because it's a waste of... Uh... Nice. <laughs> There's one just in the corner. This wall here. Some dirt. Okay, so we have 13 left. Ah, what am I doing? Balls. Hate when things go wrong tragically like that. I think that's pretty much it. All right, okay, so I'm going to call it for this episode because I'm going to finish the basement now between this episode and the next episode. Well, finish it as in putting all the concrete around. And then I will get enough resources to put the interior in. And I think what we agreed on with the interior was a cobble, cobblestone... No, sorry, a, a cement floor because it is underground. Cobblestone walls and... a dry ceiling or something a drywall ceiling I think it was the white drywall ceiling I have upstairs for above and then the brown or the cream drywall ceiling for underneath here so if you look at the drywall ceiling with the cream drywall that's what no not this one this one so this is the let's just make some paper 
And oh yeah, we don't have cement on us. Um, actually, what we need is ladders. There we go. So we can get back out. Excellent. So, in this episode, we have done a good job with the church. We have uh, updated the church. We have updated the basement. We are looking really, really good. So, I have to say now, this is, is starting to become really one of my favorite builds even more. I, I'm starting to like it even more than um, the castle. Oh, seriously, I broke my leg jumping up to... Oh, man. The guy breaks his legs coughing on it. Okay, brilliant. This is looking really nice. All right, okay, thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy this episode, kick the like button in the arse like the gaming ninjas you are. And I hope you join me in the next video. And until then, viel Spaß and happy gaming.